The biggest issue that is on the ballot is the democracy of our nation and whether we truly have the opportunity to make free choices devoid of blackmail, threats, and intimidation. That, that's, that's, that's a matter that is on the ballot, and that's a matter that many Kenyans, in fact, if you understand a bit of Kiswahili, it is inform, that's what informs the, the current push by many Kenyans to say hatupangwinkwi, meaning, <laughs> meaning we, have, we want to make our choices without being choreographed or chaperoned or blackmailed or intimidated. We are also going to be making uh, choices about our economy and the democratization of our economy. Um, there is a feeling that um, uh, our economy is, has been captured and curtailed and brokered and become exclusionist. And that's why our push is that we must democratize our economy, make it inclusive, bring everybody on board, and ensure that uh, nobody is left behind. We are looking forward to uh, the partnership of friends and people of goodwill. And America has always been a partner. Deruto described Kenya as a nation of hustlers, those struggling to make ends meet in an economy that isn't always working for them. So it is fitting to me that he would choose as one of his first stops on his tour in America, the city of Baltimore, which is, I think we can all agree, also a city of hustlers. And one of the most... And one of the most resilient, scrappy, hardworking places in the world.